Hi VFM here. Jurassic World Dominion is an upcoming American science fiction adventure film directed by Colin Trevorrow, who wrote the screenplay with Emily Carmichael, based on a story by Trevorrow and his writing partner, Derek Connolly. It is the sequel to Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom, 2018, the sixth installment in the Jurassic Park franchise, and the third film in the Jurassic World trilogy. As with its predecessors, Frank Marshall and Patrick Crowley will produce the film, with Trevorrow and Jurassic Park, 1993, director Steven Spielberg acting as executive producers. The film stars an ensemble cast including Chris Pratt, Bryce Dallas Howard, Laura Dern, Sam Neill, Jeff Goldblum, Daniela Pineda, Isabella Sermon, Justice Smith, Omar Sy, and B.D. Wong reprising their roles from previous films in the franchise, and they are joined by Mamudu Athi, Scott Hayes, Deachin Lockman, Campbell Scott, and Dewanda Wise. The film was being planned as early as 2014, a part of the future Jurassic World trilogy. Filming began in Canada in February 2020 and moved to other locations in England the following month. In March 2020, production was suspended due to the COVID-19 global pandemic. Production resumed in July 2020 and concluded four months later in November, with filming locations that included England's Pinewood Studios and the country of Malta. Jurassic World Dominion is scheduled for theatrical release on June 10, 2022, in IMAX, Real D 3D, and Dolby Cinema by Universal Pictures. Unlike its two predecessors and like the first three installments, Legendary Entertainment is not involved in its production, as Universal cut ties with the company in 2019 after the expiration of their four-year deal. In, in the US, Jurassic World Dominion is scheduled to be released theatrically by Universal Pictures on June 10, 2022. The film was previously set for release on June 11, 2021, but it was delayed due to the pandemic. The film is scheduled to stream on Universal's Peacock website within four months of its theatrical release, as part of an 18-month deal. The film would then move to Amazon Prime Video for 10 months, before returning to Peacock for the final four months. Following that 18-month deal, it will air on the Stars platform as part of Universal's post-pay-1 licensing agreement with the network. By saying this I will meet you guys in next video.